I'm Eli. And I'm Jessica. And we are both active members of the Encounter Celebrations Committee, which is based in Victor Harbour, South Australia. Our organisation is passionate about promoting and preserving one of the most significant events in the history of Australia. On the 8th of April, 1802, Sea Captains Matthew Flinders from England and Nicholas Baudin from France whilst sailing around Australia seeking new land and conducting scientific research on the indigenous population, flora and fauna for their respective countries met in the waters of Encounter Bay which is on the southern coast of South Australia. This meeting was one of the most significant historical events in Australia's maritime history culminating in the final charting of the southern coast of Australia, which resulted in the map of Australia as we know it today. Our organisation has plans to erect a major piece of artwork in the form of an interpretive sculpture featuring the stories of the two nations involved. This will be a constant reminder of this important happening in 1802. In fact, this significant sculpture will relate that it was an encounter of three cultures, the British, the French and the First Nations, the Ramanjiri, Naranjiri people of this region, whose presence was observed by them from afar. The interpretive sculpture will be situated right here in Warland Reserve Victor Harbour, which is a key public location on the southern Flurio coast, where over a million tourists visit the area each year. This area, earmarked for the sculpture, has been identified by the artist and approved by the local council. Monument Australia believes that no existing commemorative monuments or designs of this nature currently exist. This sculpture will reflect the detailed information and educational nature of such an important event. More than just a single sculpture, it will be the creation of a place that engages, enlightens, and educates, and at the same time, a place which will encourage debate, reflection of the event, along with thoughts of the land and waters of the Ramanjiri Naranjiri people, and the historic impact on both areas. This entire project has been commissioned and will be overseen by the Encounter Celebrations Committee, which is a non-profit organisation based in this area. We've engaged full-time professional award-winning artist sculptor Clancy Warner whose art practice strongly reflects on the environment and the use of recycled materials wherever possible. I'm very excited and honoured to be the chosen artist for, for this sculpture that depicts the meeting of, of Matthew Flinders and, and Bodan as well as honour the, the Naranjeri people whose land it was and is still is today. It's, uh, it's, it should be a great project and uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to it to coming to fruition. Now that we've received final approval for the design and location by the City of Victor Harbour Council, an acknowledgement and offer of assistance from the Australian Cultural Foundation, we are keen to begin our fundraising campaign to ensure the overall project is completed and erected by the 8th of April 2024, the significant date when it all began. <laughs>